Are you ready for this, Alex? Yes, I am. Wait, 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 no, they're not these. No, you're not similares. You look like a professional blogger, bro. I feel like I'm going to go pick up some Pokemon. Oh, uh, yeah, I might say it, it, it has a lanyard. What is up, guys? Welcome back to the vlog. Thank you for tuning in. So today it's a special day. I have one surprise today, and that is a new project. Yeah, I'm keeping the lanyard. Mm. Doesn't it come with the truck? No, it does not. <laughs> no. I like the language. Finally. I got a new project and I'll tell you what's going on with the GMC C15 as well. But first we're gonna check out my new project for the meantime. I'm huh? gonna put the cover. Make it more. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. I brought a cover just so I can <laughs> actually do that extra stuff. This is my new project. You ready for this? You ready? Are you ready for this, Alex? Yes, I am. It's a lot of work, all right, but that's that's just the fun of it. What do you think? Well, you sold me the truck. <laughs> yeah. Tell them what it got. Tell them what it has. So they don't call me Omar LS2 for nothing. Ladies and gentlemen, it has a six. Point oh. Current transmission. Four L eighty. Four L eighty. Yeah, right. Damn. <laughs> this is history in the making. <laughs> All right, guys. So what we're gonna be doing is hooking up the E fans because the wires, the harness is still not on there. So we're gonna take it to a guy that knows exactly what to do to connect it. As we turn on the truck, it overheats real fast. The harness is right there, but there's a guy that knows how to wire it. That way, it turns on. Here's the wire harness Damn. for the fans. We're gonna take it over there. The guy's been waiting for a good while just yeah. because we've been trying to get this surprise real good on camera. So, here we go. Close it. How's it feel? How's it feel to have a VA, bro? I mean, I drove in VAs before, but this is pretty but awesome to own. own one. I mean, I own one. a 454. It's freaking badass. <laughs> so what Alex told me is that you guys can do uh, direct connect, but he says not the best choice. No, okay, no. Well, for one, like highway use, a lot of people say with the e fans on running, it it, it blocks air. Yeah. There's no direct airflow. A hundred bucks to get you a does turn tune, on and turn off. A tune just to like actually just as soon yeah. as you turn it on, and then, it, and then, it acts with like, it. So you just think it's just best just to do the connect. Yeah, straight wire computer. Turn on when they need to. When your AC turns on, your height turns on. Everything tuned better, you know. It's more professional. So oh, yeah. what you're gonna be doing right now is just connecting it, everything, and then the other guy is gonna be tuning it so it can like yeah, 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 work. Yeah. So it can work both ways. Okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. And then everything else that you don't need the uh, the vats and all that. We're, we're gonna, not gonna get it because uh, <laughs> I mean she's leaking already, bro. She wet. <laughs> she's wet. So yeah, guys, uh, I guess that's what we're gonna be doing right now. We're not gonna we're not gonna go the getaway. No. I'm gonna do it the right way. Well, they're getting that fixed. He's telling me that uh, there's a reason why you don't run straight water. Exhibit A. You see this? 
the what am I looking at? Oh, it's cracked. Oh, right it's here. cracking. And then, well, this is this is running straight water when they freeze. Uh huh. Oh. You see this this crack right here too? <laughs> my knee cracked. <laughs> <laughs> right here? Yeah. Damn. Ah, uh, my phone cracked too. <laughs> yeah, this side too. This is because they've been beating on it a lot, right? No, it overheated. This one won't come out either. Hand burners are done. So you guys are gonna fix this thing up? Oh, it, we're done. It's just, oh, you're done. Oh, it's a new motor. This is a different motor. This yeah, is the yeah, old yeah. motor. That block is trash. What is this? Look, five three, six zero. Oh no, yeah, no, no. This is five three. Five three. Yeah. Still looks nice. Yeah. He went with just an original setup. We're Damn. gonna cam it and everything too. So that uh, the cam bearings came out. Yeah. You guys have a lot of old schools. Yeah, it's forty. This place is awesome. 40, 49. It's all the motors we've done. Um, so right now I'm running antifreeze and water. 50-50. 50-50. You can't always run straight antifreeze. Honestly. What color is antifreeze? It looks orange. It's orange, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So right now I'm running antifreeze and water, 50-50. Oh, just to prove to you guys that I am, here's some orange right here. You can tell that is orange. Yeah. Uh, don't run straight water because them cracks will happen. So we're plugging in the e-fans and then this is ground right here. Checking for power? Yeah, no power. You need ground. See like this one? This one's power. Oh, was it 11.9? Yeah, those. Those are dead. I think these are dead, huh? Mm. Yeah, do a key on. Okay. Yeah, I think these are dead. Yeah. Alright guys, so everything's set up. Wires and everything. He's about to tune it. Gonna tune the fans to communicate with the computer. Just command the fans on. Give it a little bass tune maybe. So you just located here or what? Yeah. What's this place called? Barraza Customs. <laughs> Thing sounds like it has a turbo. Doesn't get any mail. Probably got catch me up on this, but I flipped one of those before. <laughs> yeah, this thing is pretty awesome. I don't know if you'll believe me, but I flipped one of these before. <laughs> it was so bad, it caught on fire, and I was about to pee that out. Yeah, real quick. Don't worry, I'm not gonna drive, or maybe. This thing is turbo. No seatbelt. No seatbelt. It's all bolt-on, boost tubes, wastegate, tuning, exhaust, stuff like that. Just basic K&M XDP. It's an 18. 18? Yep. It's a what again? It's a X3 Turbo R. I need this in my life too. So I can flip it and say, at least it's mine. <laughs> Does this seat move? <laughs> Yeah. 
pretty pretty uh, impressive, huh? Yeah, it was. <laughs> I mean, I love to see everything else, but the damn rocks kept hitting my head. Yeah. He, so he, this man was talking about this little car racing my truck. I feel like I'm gonna be embarrassed if I lose. Just but fun. It's all for fun. It's all for, fun. It's all for making, putting more content out there and having right. fun with it. Sure. But uh, it weighs a thousand. Probably full bolt-on. Yeah, all bolt-on, all motor, little turbo. Let me show you guys what I'm looking at. <laughs> this is the one that he's talking about. And trust me when I say I'm doing it for you guys because it's gonna be very embarrassing if I lose. You ready? Yeah, hey, maybe if he'll feel bad enough, he'll feel sorry for me. He'll let me borrow it to go hunting one day, you know? They're still working on the fans right now. We're finished, you know? Uh, we're yeah, just okay. we're zip, zip tying everything. Zip tie is the best friend right there. Zip tie and duct tape. Never fails. Never fails. I got a lot, a lot of zip ties. Is that? What? We're on. We're on? Turn it on. Oh. Here, boys. Here we go. Woo. We're in there. We need, we need that in Texas. We need it. Really bad. AC's next. AC's next? AC's you next. do ACs? I don't think I have AC. No, you don't. Me, have I don't, right? <laughs> yeah. You definitely don't have I AC. I don't have AC. Well, I guess that's something that really has to happen. All right, so are we ready to go out there and see if it pops? Yeah, we're all good. The beans, you gotta give it the beans. Yeah. Are we gonna do this? He can- No, man, just- He can, uh, let me get- <laughs> No! <laughs> okay. When in doubt, tune it out. Oh. What? What? There's no watts. Trying to hear some fireworks. You still recording? I'm still recording. For real? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Get What's up then? I don't know. He's a tuner. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the O2s are probably not working. I mean, it's 450 and that's like their static number. Yeah, and it's adding fuel and it's not responding. So I'm gonna have to do everything with wide band. Okay. More technical difficulties, but it's a fun project. Let me um, let me get a hose clamp. You're you're leaking antifreeze. Out of the more and more technical difficulties. So I was leaking coolant right now from. Am I looking at it right? Hold on, right here. And there's a misfire on cylinder eight. So. Positivity yeah. all around. We're gonna get it done though, we're gonna fix that. As soon as we turned it on. He hasn't even tuned it yet. For the beans, pop up. I, I thought he was bullish. No cap. Go, go back to where it says. Can you see that face again? That, that, no, that slow-mo face. <laughs> this way, and then slowly. <laughs> it says, it's technically saying that this is a Chevy truck. And it is literally telling you, it's not a GMC truck. Please return to make GMC, GMC, GMC. I've been lied to. <laughs> a GMC. Oh, man, I gotta go check it. Just a computer. No, it's just a computer. It's just a computer? Yeah. It would say like 2002. It'll correct me right now. So that's why it was misfiring or what do you think? Nah, nah we'll find out. Nah, it could be fuel good. injector, coil, yeah, spark like plugs, box plug wire. 2002 Chevrolet Silverado 6.0. PO three hundred, PO four o five, P one six three eight. The alternator? The alternator is going out. Alternator. Nah. It's just a cool. But the battery's dying oh. fast. Battery's dying fast. You don't think it's the alternator? Nah, we'll, we'll find out. Could be over the coil packs. Coil packs, fuel injectors like clogged, dirty, tucked open. This thing has been loose. sitting for a while. Think yeah. it'll make it on? We'll find out. <laughs> All right, so they're saying that the plugs are mainly mostly the problem. A lot of octane booster was run through them things. A lot. A lot. Oh. So previous owner <laughs> me over. <laughs> uh. 
Well, what do you think I should do? Not do the beans today and just... Yeah, we'll just get it running, driving pretty close. Uh, then we'll change plugs and then we'll get it all straightened out. Oh, and you all the plugs all around? And you need, yeah, you still need this hose clamp right here. Oh yeah, the hose clamp. Unless you want to do the hose that goes to the... Yeah, I'm gonna try to do that. I mean, that's the best option, ain't it? Yeah. For right now, I'd put a hose clamp on it. Cause it's yeah, leaking. So it's leaking. Yeah, it's leaking bad. This lifestyle ain't easy. Yeah, that's true. I mean, they're better. No, let's get that one. That's gone right here. That, oh, that wait, one no. Right. Yeah, tomorrow. Today's problem is overheating. Trying to get that out of the way with the E fans. Boom. Done. Oh, yeah. I was going to explain what happened to the C15. We'll talk about it in the next vlog. I'm sorry. I'm just too tired to even talk about it right now. <laughs> Right now, they ain't even the video, the ones that you told me about. They're different brands, what? Oh, it's a different brand. <laughs> Wait, they're different brands. These are the same, but that's a different brand. This one's a different brand. Oh, damn, it's like pencil stickers. These are NGKs. What the fuck is that? They see, don't in my box. That's why they're misfiring like a mother. You said seven, cylinder seven is doing the same thing? Yeah, I mean, pretty much all of them, but I mean, eight, seven, and five are like. Bro, this one's loose. <laughs> Damn, that bitch already came out. <laughs> it's loose. They're all loose. That bitch already came out. You think that's why it probably has a miss? Five was misfiring and it was loose too. No mind shit, bro. I bet the last one that I'm in is loose too. Yeah, it's loose. I ain't even. Oh, put them, put them right there. Are they all the same brand? It's the LC Doco, NGK. Browser Customs. Okay, well, you guys came through. I didn't know it was gonna take this. Literally called five minutes ago. It's here, five minutes later. So we're gonna put these uh, NGK spark plugs V Power TR5s. We're gonna get her done. Get her done. Hopefully we can get the truck running and we can put the bang. Bang tuned by the night. They're saying, well, you're saying that uh, cylinder eight and cylinder one are still misfiring. So we're gonna change the coils tomorrow and see if that's the problem. And if it is, I'll just go buy some new coil packs. I mean, just for those two. We're still gonna tune it. I forgot about that. Let me know in the comments, what do you think? Should I make the beans tune or regular tune? Beans tune is it's popping at 4,000 RPMs. Yeah, that's already got that. Huh? It's already got it right now. Like right oh, it does? Three grand, yeah. Three grand? Yeah. Damn. Damn right. Oh, damn, one more time, one more time. That was actually pretty awesome. Damn, that's awesome. Hold on. So let me know. Right now she's on the on the on the that tune, on the bean tune. And if you guys just want it to be normal, let me guys know in the comments below. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today. Like and subscribe, turn the bell notification on, become part of Legacy, and we'll see you on the next. We will be talking a little bit more detail on what's going on on the next video. So appreciate it, man. Yeah, yo. People are, gonna, people are gonna hate. Oh yeah, they're gonna hate. But we'll see what they think.
<laughs> that was awesome. Do it again? Yeah. Temperature, what's the temperature right now? 190. 190? Yeah. Everything stable? Yeah. 210, 190, trans tamp, 125. What was going on with the other tune before this one? It had like 28 degrees of timing and then it's, it was still adding to it through the, like with fueling. What? You got so, the uh, the history on that one? This is the original one right here. High octane. Well, it had 26 degrees of timing. Oh, it was all over the place, huh? Well, 26 is not bad. I mean, if you're running 93, but it just, it depends on each engine. And then they were still adding two and a half degrees to it. So it was like 28 degrees. 28 degrees of timing, so 26 here. And this weird house, a little spike right there. It was a very aggressive tune. Oh, damn, go back. Yeah, it was all. Look at that. It's just wacky. That ain't normal. Yeah, so you didn't smooth anything, everything out. 28 degrees of timing. It just depends on each engine. Like some of them will take it, some of them is just. Yeah, this this motor is not original on this truck, so everything's different. Yeah, we're just gonna put the regular tune on here. Um, we're gonna fix every little detail we that we need and then we're gonna go back to the bean tune or I don't know for sure but I really like them. but let me know what you guys think on the comments below what do you guys think about the bean, the bean tune uh, you know popping fireworks or just a regular soft V8 sound all right bro appreciate you like subscribe turn the bell notification on become part of legacy and we'll see you on the next vlog now it's over Porque la de mi camarada mexicana